Labor's not quite calling for David, it. David Lipson, let me just jump in on you. Sorry to interrupt, yeah. but we just need to take everyone. We're going to come back to you in a moment. We just want to go to this police media conference about these two arrests. Let's have a listen in quickly. That's all I can really say about it at this time, other than to say to the people in Katandra Crescent and Primrose Street in Essendon, the men that have charged, we firmly believe, are responsible for the arson attacks and the recent events in those areas. I would also like to thank the community of Victoria for their ongoing assistance in this investigation and also the efforts of the members of the armed crime squad in resolving this in a very timely manner. Are you looking for anyone else? I can't take any more questions in relation to this. As you would understand, they've been charged. All right, well, that's all he can say about that, whatever he said before we got to it. But um, <laughs> I don't know. Let's just go back to David Lipson in Canberra. David, uh, I'm not interested in that anyway, to be perfectly honest. But look, let's talk, let's talk about this situation involving the Speaker, entitlements more broadly, mm. uh, the way that it's been swung around on Bill Shorten a little bit. I mean, the sum total of this, what, you have some hope that something might come out of this? I'm gonna